schooner exact. They came from the south. From Portland, they sailed through the Columbia's mouth. Twenty-two settlers, fresh off the trail, came to the south with wind in their sail. With wind in their sail. A whole Denny part, some twenty-five strong, left the Midwest on the trail so long. They sent forward scouts who traveled by land, built us a cabin that was their domain. Mm -hmm. That was their domain. At Alki Beach, the party arrived, finding their cabin and scouts alive. Young David Denny had started a home; it still had no roof. He was trenched to the bone. He was drenched to the bone. As the stormy November emptied the sky, the women and children could not help but cry. A young chief, Seattle, lent them a hand. His tribe, the Duwamish, a kind Indian band. Duwamish people had lived here so long. Their cousins Suquamish shared in their song. Big clams and salmon, sweet berries galore. A plenty to share, though not even a store. Not even a store. With the help of Seattle. The winter would pass. They soon would be joined by settlers in mass. By springtime, they moved to the east of the bay to start a new town, forever to stay. Forever to stay. First called the Wumps, it needed a name. Good old Doc Maynard made the first claim. Name it Seattle, the chief is our friend. His name became legend, and that is the end. Or the beginning, or how it got started, you know, history. <laughs> <laughs>